Biafran group resume agitation in sea. Ban and threatens to set any vessel entering peninsula through Nigeria on fire. You see, the Biafran day is a day for the Biafrans. And it should be a day that should be uh, that 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 the Biafrans are given the opportunity to uh, remember the fallen heroes, the fallen heroes, the fallen Biafrans, those that fought tooth and nail. Those that fought for their struggle, those that fought for the existence of the Southeast. You see that? So they say that this day must be observed, shouldn't be an issue. It will only be an issue. If we try to deny them of that very day, they are not asking for too much. For too much, according to me, that's what I feel. To me, they are not asking for too much. If they are saying that no vessel must cross peninsula because of that very day, is so so be it. So be it. So what's the, what's the problem? What's the problem and what's the issue? So, it is. I think it's since yesterday they have been passing the message, and I think uh, the time they have spent passing the message is even enough. It's on the thirtieth, yet they have started passing the message earlier. So nobody will say that he or she is not informed or he or she is not aware, except we want to we want to cross our boundary. You understand. It's just want to cross our boundary. So to me, they haven't asked for too much. They haven't asked for too much. What they have asked for is something that every uh, 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 country seeking for a republic will always ask for. Be mind, my, um, and be, my, mind, be mindful. Biafran itself is a republic. It's a republic. So what are we saying? So, we on our own side should be able to understand the area these people are coming from and give to them what truly belongs to them. They have said it. Look at, for you to know that they meant what they, uh, what they are doing, aside from agitating on road, they have to resume agitation even on sea to see if there is any anyone trying to bring in any vessel oh my god these these people are ready they are fuckingly ready fuckingly ready they know why they have to resume the agitation through sea because they know that there is nothing nigerian cannot do they can decide to bring in any vessel through sea so they are minding the, 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 their environment, their community, both through road and through sea. In case of any unnecessary invaders. You see that? That is it. So let us not say these people again or these people have started. No, it is, it is their right. Let's give it to them. Okay, look at what they have said. Some militias suspected to be members of the Biafran Nation League BNL has resurfaced, threatening to continue the fight for Biafran independence in the Gulf of Guinea. In a recent video circulating online, the military group numbering up to five were seen armed with local guns, a Biafran flag and peddling a boat in Achibong town, Isangele subdivision, in the ceded Bakasi Peninsula area. The group, 
who said they are BNL member under Bakasi vowed to continue the fight for Biafra. We are freedom fighters under Bakasi base. We have been suffering a lot, they said. The group added, this is Bakasi Peninsula. We are around the riverside now inside Isangele as far as Bakasi is concerned. We no get plenty talk to tell Una, but they don't decide to join Biafra and we will continue the fight. Biafra Nation League through its chief head of operations, Henry Edet, had earlier issued threats to shut down the peninsula and ban foreign vessels from entering Nigeria on the 30th May 2021. Biafra Memorial Day, saying Biafra Nation League have banned all foreign vessels from entering Nigerian through the Biafra coastal line of Bakasi Peninsula. Following deaf ears paid to the killings and incident arrests going on in the former Eastern Nigerian by the international communities, Biafra Nation League Marine Squad will apprehend any foreign group or individuals vessel seen around our territory from May 30th. This also applies to Cameroon. International business works only where there is peace. The pro Biafran group disclosed that preparation for Biafran Day has continued as BNL members resurfaced after clash with Cameroon. BIR in Bakasi Peninsula to host flag on May 30th despite threats. Recall that the group reportedly clashed with a troop of Cameroon Battalion's intervention rapid squad in Isangele, area of Bakasi Peninsula, a few days ago. Biafra Nation League insisted that movements of foreign vessels along coastal line remain banned. In response, Cameroon has since beefed up security in the region as well as the Nigerian Navy. <laughs> Intelligent. All right. Well, these guys, I'll tell you, they are, they are out fully. Let's just give it to them and allow that very day to be observed. To let the sleeping dog to lie. Do you understand? That is, if we don't want war. All right, my dear viewers, I don't know what your own opinion concerning this may be. Please don't forget to leave your comment below the comment box. Click on the subscription button, as well as the bell button, to receive more updates. Thank you.